Can you call Archer? I can't do this video with him. Archer, come here. He's like bumping the camera, like moving it. It's just a disaster. Archer. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel where we talk about Christmas stuff. As you can see, things got a little bit Christmassy. I mean, it's only in the corner of the video, so just a little Christmas corner. For those of you who don't know me personally, um, and I'm really hoping there's not lipstick on my teeth. Okay, I wanna say first that I tried to do something like different with my makeup today because I was like, ooh, I'm gonna film a Christmas video and I'm gonna be like spicy. I did my like eyeshadow and it just, I ended up with like pink all down my face. It looked very avant-garde, but um, so my eyeshadow was a hot mess today. I just went with it and then I slapped on this lip that I was like, there's gonna be red all over my teeth. It's just gonna look like not cute, but we're here, we're filming, we're doing it, yes. Today, I am bringing you guys a Christmas, a Target Christmas haul video. So I know that everybody says that you should shop local, which I too agree, so please don't judge me. Target is just one of the most beautiful places and has been my saving grace in this pandemic. I didn't shop locally for all of my Christmas stuff that I'm putting in my house, but like I said, this is where I'm at. Alan and I went to Target. We got a bunch of Christmas stuff because for those of you who don't know, this is our first year. Well, this is technically our second Christmas in our new house that we got last year, but we went to Nashville to visit my sister for Christmas. So, um, so we didn't really get to like, decorate last year we didn't decorate at all so that's kind of why this year we went like all out we got super excited I mean we didn't go all out but we went kind of all out we went to Target a couple weeks ago and then we went to Target again and then we went to Target again and we yeah basically we go to Target every weekend we went there and we spent about 200 to 250 dollars on Christmas stuff which I think is actually really good to like completely pretty much completely decorate our our place and I mean we're lacking like a few things in our bedroom and everything but we had pretty much no Christmas decorations Christmas was my father's birthday Christmas day so um, it's just a really big thing in my family. Growing up, we did huge parties. We had people over every Christmas Eve, like everybody came over. Our house was decorated. Like, I mean, we were like those people that like decorated their house so much that it was borderline embarrassing, okay? Like everywhere you looked, there were Christmas decorations. So my dad would start like in november he would play christmas movies and he would decorate our whole entire house i loved it i loved every minute of it i loved christmas i loved spending christmas with him um i loved celebrating him i loved celebrating the holiday and um now my dad is no longer with us and so christmas is a little bit a little bit sad for me it's really sad for me guys. <laughs> I won't get emotional, but yeah, it's, it's, it's hard. Um, and this year, I feel like like the last few years I've kind of strayed away from like doing a lot of Christmas stuff. A, cause we had small places. B, because like, I don't know. I feel like I just like wasn't ready to do it myself. Like to kind of dig into that part of my grief where like, I knew it would be really hard to decorate my house and to like not have my my dad there to talk about Christmas with, to like send him pictures and consult and just like get his advice because he was amazing at decorating. I think I've been kind of like avoiding it, but this year 
I feel like I was just ready. I like went to Target and I remember I like went through one of the aisles and I got to the Christmas section and I was just like, oh my God, I went, Christmas. Like, and this lady was just like, she ended up coming over to us and she was like, I really need you in my house for Christmas because you're so excited. And um, I don't know, it was just like one of the first times in a long time that I felt that like super joyous feeling about Christmas and decorating and like, I don't know, just being able to like make my own traditions and kind of like make my dad proud because he loved Christmas. And um, I don't know, I think he would be really excited to see like how much I've grown as a person and what I'm doing with my life. And the, I don't know, I think he would be excited to see just like how I decorate for Christmas, you know, like what my life is like. And I wish he was here to share all that with. Um, but he's not. And um, and so we're making our own traditions here in the Straker Ramirez household. And yeah, we got a bunch of decorations from Target and I wanna show them to you. I wanna share them with you because I am super excited and maybe it can give you some ideas of ways you can decorate. So long spiel over, let's get into this video. I'm gonna show you all of the Christmas decorations that we got at Target. It's really not that many, but I'm super excited. Christmas, Christmas is here. Christmas, Christmas is here. So, oh, oh, a tragedy has struck. My pillow hit the Christmas tree. Something you should know about Alan is he does not like throw pillows. Alan kind of knows that like Christmas and because of my dad, it's like, <laughs> I'm very specific about how I want things. And so when I told him I wanted Christmas throw pillows, I think he was just like, okay, fine. Like, just give that to her because that's really gonna make her happy at Christmas. He's a sweetie. So the first one I wanna show you, I'm really excited about. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh, wait, can you see it? <gasps> Merry Christmas. <laughs> oh, it's so, it's so pretty. I went searching for the perfect like throw pillows um, and I didn't want anything like gaudy because I feel like a lot of Christmas stuff is gaudy. So I, I don't know, we were in the sections at Target in the pillow section and I found these. What I mean by these is that I got another one. It says Noel. Oh, so many things in this camera shot. I don't even know how I'm gonna do it all. <laughs> this one says Noel. Can you see it? Noel! There's some big cojones, I'm telling you. So the next pillow I'm really excited to share with you guys. It reminds me a lot of my dad. I saw this pillow and I was like, Alan, I need this third pillow. We weren't gonna get a third pillow. And he was like, just get it. Just get it, it reminds you of your dad, do it. So, I love this pillow so much. It is so cute. It reminds me so much of my dad, little station wagon with a tree on top. Um, so my dad's favorite movie was, I think his all time favorite Christmas movie. He had a lot of favorites, but he loved Christmas Vacation. So this reminds me of Christmas Vacation. And we used to watch that every year in our house. Like when my dad started putting up decorations, he would put, he would like do, um, watch a Christmas movie and I would come home from school and he'd be decorating and singing and doing Christmas. And it was just, I don't know, super cool. <sighs> so that's where I got that idea. So that's my third throw pillow. I really like it, it's really cute. The next thing I wanted to get was a table runner. We have a cute little dining room table and I wanted something pretty to put on it. So um, I got this table runner. It's really pretty. If you, I don't know if you can see, but it has these like red, let's see if I can show you. It has these like really pretty red details on the ends. It's just very like modern, modern. It does look super cute. So, Miss Decorator over here, just decorating. So we got these cute little Mrs. Claus Bakery. I'm sure there's 50,000 people that have these. 
because they were in the little like three dollar bin. So these were like three bucks. I wanted something to decorate the kitchen and make it look pretty. The next set of hand towels that we got is for our bathroom. And we did a little Feliz Navidad moment. So I think these were like five dollars. They're a matching little set. Ah, I look so Christmassy with them. I really like the little pom poms. They have little pom poms on the bottom. Let's see if I can. Ugh, this is really hard. Oh, so cute, Target. Anyways, Alan says he doesn't really like it anymore, but I still like them. We got a bunch of like little decorative pieces to just like put on our table, put in the bathroom. So this guy goes in the bathroom. I think he's super cute. Look how cute he is. Hey, I just, I want him to be my boyfriend. Don't tell Alan. Um, yeah, he is, I think he's like, I think he was $10, so $10. Not too bad. So I think we have a total of, watch me total this up and it'd be like way more than I told you in the beginning and that's kind of embarrassing, but 45. Oh gosh, math, I can't do it. I can't do it. It's math. He's super cute. Stop. I mean, as much as I want it to focus on me, I like the camera to focus on him. Beauty shots. Mm. My cat is freaking out. Archer, do not instigate. It's like having children in this house. It's like having children. So next, um, I'm gonna do this cute little tree. This was $10. Cute little, it has like little Christmas trees. My dad used to have like little ones of these in his village. So I got like this big one, $10. We put it on our mantle. It has like really cute little, I don't know, like colorful lights and like a little snow capped on top. So that's really cute. Next, I have these really cute gnomes. These were $5 each. So $10 total. Alan and I saw them and we loved them. It's like a little him and I moment. Like, although neither of these, I mean, they don't look like us, but still it's a little him and her moment. So um, look how cute they are. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I love them. Okay, I'll show you one at a time. Look at this little braid like in front of the nose. And this guy's got his little beard. So we pair our little gnomes with the Christmas tree. And I think it's a really cute little moment. Okay, I think it's a cute moment. You're a cute moment. Thanks, Bay. This was $5 that we got um, just to put like on our on our dining room table, just as like a cute little piece. It's just this little cranberry plant. I'm not kidding you guys, this was $5. $5 and it looks so cute. So see what I'm saying? Like we got so much good stuff and so many of these pieces were like five, $10. And yeah, it does add up, but like if you're trying to decorate your whole house, like I don't know, you get a bunch of, a bunch of really cute stuff. The next thing is these little nut crackers. They're so cute. She's got like some crazy hair. Oh my gosh, it's so funny. They're so cute together. And they say 2020 on the bottom. See here, if I can get it to focus. It's not working. I thought like it would be cute to like collect new ones every year and Alan and I can have a little nutcracker collection. He doesn't know that I want to collect one every year, but I'm going to surprise him. He's not going to be super excited about that. Look at it like opens, it opens and closes. I, I don't know. It's for some nut cracking, but I'm, I don't know, not really doing much nut cracking over here. So. I found these and um, I actually saw them online first. They're $10 each and they're so cute. And I just had to have like a couple of them to like just put around the house. So the first one is like this little, oh my gosh, it's $10 for this, but it's this cute little trailer. Look at it. It kind of broke on the way home. So that's the quality we're going for here. But um, 
I think that's just because we had it in a bag with a bunch of other stuff. I'm sure it would have been fine otherwise. But yeah, it's so cute. It has like little lights on the inside of the window. You can hear my dog whining because he's trapped upstairs because he was moving the camera. So once again, that's where we're at. Alan picked this one out and he really liked it. He thought it was really cute. It's a little blimp. $10 guys, says North Pole. Has a little presents in it, Christmas tree. Mm, so cute, $10, Target. Shop local. So these were like $30 total. Not like the cheapest for these, like, but I really wanted them. So we just, we did it. We spent $30 on them. Um, so we got another one of these little station wagons with a Christmas tree on it. It has little Christmas lights on the side. <gasps> Reminds me of my dad again. Has a little thing on the front. See if I can get it to focus. It's so cute. Christmas, Christmas from Target. The second to last thing that I wanna show you guys is um, these cute little Christmas tree decorations that I got at Target. These were also in the like, right when you get in the front door, the $5 section. And honey, they are cute. So I got them. They were $3 each, so it was a total of $9. And they're super cute. So there's they're these little stuffed Christmas trees. Ah! Are you kidding me? Look at these. I put these two on our dining room table with the berry plant, and it's really, really cute. I love it. Get on in here. So we got this really cute little string of lights. It has all these different colors. It's a little garland. Um, I think this was $10. So once again, another five to $10 thing, super cheap, really great price and is really cute. We've been putting this up in our loft, like strung across our TV stand and it looks really cute. Okay, this is really cute. You're gonna die. I got this really cute little reindeer. It's like a little wooden reindeer. Look at it, it's got little legs. Anyways, I got this last year <laughs> at Home Depot. He's such a cute little guy, I love him. Um, he's made of wood, he's pretty sturdy. He's just like a little homemade looking deer. I wanted two of them. I feel like he was like $25, so he was kind of expensive, so we didn't get two of him because that would have been $50 this honey ain't got that much money. So um, we just got one, but he's really cute and I love him. <sighs> okay, so just wrapping up this video, the last thing we got um, were a couple of candles. These candles were, these candles were $5 each, okay? I think they were five, maybe they were 10. Um, I'll link everything in the description below that we got and you can see all the prices of everything. I might have been wrong on some prices, but um, yeah, I'll link everything in the description below. We got this a couple of candles. This is the Mary Berry candle. It smells like Mary and berries. Can you believe it? No, it smells like berries. I don't know guys, it just smells really good. Alan and I don't really like Christmas candles because a lot of them tend to be like pumpkin spice and they smell like just like sugar threw up all over your nostrils and it's just not fun. So, we tend to like not gravitate towards those candles. We tend to gravitate towards like fruity candles and stuff like that. Um, but we smelled these Christmas candles and we were shook. Let me tell you, we were obsessed. So this is the Mary Berry. I think we got one that was like an apple crisp. Oh, it smells so good. I've been burning it every single day while I work. Um, it's like, and it's lasted for days. I think I've burned it a total of like almost 24 hours and um, it's like not even halfway gone. So these candles are awesome. They're super cheap. I think they're just a target. Yeah, they're threshold. So they're just target brand. So they're awesome. So if you look back there, there's also Christmas tree we got at Target. Our Christmas tree is a six foot pre-lit Christmas tree. We got it for $35. Actually, no, I think it was like 42. I'm gonna link it below. Super good price for a pre-lit six foot Christmas tree. We were just looking for something cheap because we didn't want to spend a ton of money. So there we have it. All right, guys. So the sun is starting to peek through. I've gone through all my stuff that we got. 
Um, and I think it's about time we wrap up this video. Um, my Target haul, I feel like it was a success this year. We got a couple other things that I didn't share, but I feel like we have enough footage. I feel like we have enough stuff. We got a wreath and we got a doormat that was pretty cool, but I don't wanna haul those back in because they've been sitting outside. They're probably kind of dirty from people stepping on them. Um, I'm going to link everything in the description below, like I said, and you guys can pick out some of the things if you liked them. Yeah, I'm just really excited about this video. I'm really hyped for Christmas this year. That's pretty much it for this haul. It was super fun. It was fun hanging out with you guys. I love sharing a little bit about myself and why Christmas means so much to me. That was super fun. And just kind of sharing like how Alan and I like to decorate our house. Um, yeah, it's exciting. So thank you so much for watching. I can't wait to create more videos like this, just lighthearted videos. I'm, I'm gonna have a lot of videos on my weight and losing weight and all these things, and that's really what this channel is about. But um, I also wanna have just like some fun, lighthearted content that makes you just happy and, and is inspiring and is real and fun. So that's what we're going for. I think we nailed it with this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate you, I don't know, just taking the time to look at my videos. Um, I know I'm a little weird, I'm a little out there. I don't know, I don't need to apologize. I am me and I'm happy with who I am. I'm excited. I feel like I've grown a lot in myself and I've come to the place that I don't need to be anything for anybody else. I just wanna be myself. So that's what you're gonna get on this channel. You're gonna get the real me, silly, funny, quirky, really terrible eyeshadow sometimes, really crusty lips, I don't know, some flab all over the place, and that's just me, that's me, that's, that's who you're getting. Please um, click the like button if you like this video, subscribe, and turn on the notifications, ding the notification bell, so that you can get notifications of the next time I upload. And I will see you guys in my next video. Goodbye. You are my baby. Stop it, stop. You think my makeup looks good today? Stop. Silver bells, silver bells. I'm being cut off. This is gonna be a lot of really shitty content. <sighs> this is where we're at.